welcome back to already the fifth episode of the road back to India. In this episode I want to talk a little bit about the vaccines that I got before I went to India and if I need any, I'm going to check if I need any updates. Also some of you guys asked me to talk a little bit more about vaccines and what I got before I went to Southeast Asia because India is not the only country I visited. My personal opinion is that yes you should get all the vaccines that are prescribed by your government to get for a certain country. So for instance, uh, in the Netherlands, we have the Rijksoverheid. They have a website, you just type in the country and you get a list of vaccines that you need for the country that you're going to. And I'm quite sure that most other countries have such a website as well. So what I did, me personally, I got all the shots that were listed and even a little bit more extra shots. So this is what I got. I got the hepatitis A and B vaccine. I got the rabies vaccine. This is also a controversial one because it doesn't protect you from dying. It just gives you a little bit more time. And if you are bitten by an animal with rabies, you only need to get two shots in hospital instead of five. So you can still die if you get the vaccine, but it just gives you a little bit more time and you have to get less shots. For me, this was very important because it gives me freedom. So let me just give you an example of what I mean by this freedom. I went to the Indian countryside with Kabir. If an animal with rabies would have bitten me, I would have had more time to get to the hospital. Of course, we were very remote. I don't know where the hospital was or how much time it would take us to get to the hospital. And also, I would only need to get two shots instead of five. Um, yeah, meaning it's, it's, you know, it's easier to stay, to not die, <laughs> basically. So for me, that was very important. Also, I got the DTP vaccine. I got the typhoid vaccine. I also got another one uh, for Japanese encephalitis, something like that. You know... Again, for the freedom that I wanted to give myself. Another thing are malaria pills. I didn't take them with me because I wasn't planning on visiting any areas with malaria. But I know a lot of people don't take them and they just, you know, spray themselves with DEET. Because the most of the malaria pills, they give you such horrible side effects, nightmares, they make you paranoid, stuff like that. And to be very honest, I think I would choose for the same option because the, you know, the, um, the side effects of those pills would ruin your travels. And yeah, of course it's not worth dying. But at the same time, if you use DEET and you're very cautious about that, I think it should be okay. My friend Claudia for the Dutchies, she has this website, backpackgek.nl. She, she made really good posts about this in Dutch. So if you're interested, you can check that out. Also check out Rachel from Hippie and Heels for, for the English speaking people among us. So yeah, looking at my vaccines, I'm quite protected for this year. Oh, something that's very important. If you are getting vaccines, start on time. Because for instance, for hepatitis, you need to have, I think, from the top of my head, to be safe, I'm going to say you need to start six months before you leave because there, um, there needs to be a certain time be between shots in order to make them work, uh, you know, properly. So to round this all up, of course, it's up to you if you're willing to get any vaccines or not. But my personal advice and opinion is that, yes, you should get the vaccines that your governor, government prescribes for that country because you're simply putting yourself from a very different environment into an environment that you're just simply not used to. And there are different hygiene standards. You're just not used to that way of life. If you have a different opinion, let me know down in the comments below because it's a, it's a controversy. Should you get vaccines or not? And there are like pros and cons to every story, but this is just my opinion and my advice that I would give to any friend of mine who would ask me like, should I get vaccines or not? Yes, you should get them and just check, check the website of your government and the vaccines that you need. If you like this video, please put a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, please click that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week.